The Let's Play you're about to view is rated M for Mature. Viewer discretion is advised. One final thing, let's mm -hmm. check my fortune. Before want... the recording? Yeah. I need us to know how things are gonna go. That's a bad idea. Huh. What? Apparently I'm gonna be unusually successful in business. That's a good sign for our Let's Plays. For this episode. I really like this, this way we're doing this, because now we get to see Gabe's reactions to everything. I wish we could have seen that to the cannibals. Yeah. Because he would have been so fucking smug. Previously on The Walking Dead. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. Well, here isn't doing us any good. You should think about coming with us, you and Clem. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it! No! <laughs> Sounds like a car. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. You're right. We shouldn't take this. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. So... That lady was I, bad shit insane. Not bad I shit insane. <laughs> not bad shit insane. How did you fuck up? Gabe, I will say this right now, you didn't fuck up. No, I didn't fuck up, but we fucked up by killing the uh, farm because now they don't have any supplies and now we're fucked. Not quite. So guys, welcome back to The Walking Dead. In this issue, we're actually doing things a little bit different than before. In that we're actually all here together. Justin, stop playing with that bake. I was gonna get a chip, but I stopped myself because, you know, you have a stupid rule about not eating during recordings, you muffin. <laughs> Alright, so how we're doing this is that we're actually... I'm on vacation, and we went over to Cassie's house, so we're all recording here. I am also on vacation. What's up, sluts? By the way, um... Let's see what happened to the Everett Pharmacy when we left. Looks like it, things are a little bit worse. Oh, like there's zombies. oh, there's a helicopter in the pharmacy. Damn it! Well, at least we weren't here for that. Uh huh. Well, you know, Jaja. Lucky day. <sighs> maybe. Yeah, maybe. They tend to take us by surprise. Yeah. Well, the less I see, the happier I am. I love the post-apocalyptic setting because of shit like this. Everything got wrecked. There's nothing left. But you still have to be afraid like you're out in the goddamn wild. Because now, it's not animals you have to be afraid of, it's the walking dead. Title drop. Anyway. So, what we're looking at here is after the after the farm incident, Lee, shit where you come down on staying or going? You mean, packing up the motel and getting in the RV? Yeah, we've been talking about it, but have you made up your mind yet? Honestly, I don't have to go. We should go. The motel's run its course, and it's not safe. you damn right it has. We pile into the RV and don't pull over till we see water. And if Lily's dead set on staying, then, well, that's the way it goes. I want to point out something very interesting here. As I was saying a second ago, Everything has okay, gone sideways like here. Over the rig, this has the been maybe a few days to a couple weeks since they everything went sideways at the farm. They've they been staying at the motor inn for... Something's better than nothing. I'd say roughly half a year. You think at, so? Half a year at the very most. Shit. Been a you few okay? months. Some ladders come loose. It I'm has sure been... Because remember, got in her. between I'm season sure one and season two was three months. Then look at what happened here. At this point, we're we're pretty far into how think into things. At the very least, it's been a couple of months. This place has fallen apart. I don't think they've been at the motor for half a year. I think they've been there maybe three months. Wait, no, it was already established they'd been there three months between season one and two. Uh, episode one, two. Yeah. I thought it was two months. No. Uh, you know what? Friggin' let's open up and see what we can get inside. 
Lily's not doing so good, huh? Well, we killed her dad. Well, we killed her dad. We did kill her dad. <laughs> Everybody gonna mention just continuously that we killed her dad. Well, we kind of did. Yep. Damn it, Justin, you messed it up. You were supposed to say we killed her dad in the sentence. And you fucked it. I'm not making any memes out of this. <laughs> Alright. Well, we should take advantage of all our memes. It's not like we Why is there so up. much blood here but no bodies? I wonder. Mm. Yeah, that's kind of a thing with zombies. They, they don't eat everything. No, they bleed and then they walk away. Okay. Yeah, that, that's not even a puzzle, that's just, you know, logic. Your girl's still upset with me for taking stuff out of that car last week? Last week. Okay. So, like... What do you think? It's only been a week Christ. since the shit went down I've heard the farm. They probably took What's some of the food that done. they found at the farm, like at least the bread and shit. Yeah, that's the thing. Logically, it makes sense to do it, but you, you, you gotta think about other people. That's... Clement, Clementine's truly altru altruistic throughout the entirety of season one. There's no safe way through that. Well, that's what I'm saying. They probably took the rest of the bread. Yeah. They probably went back later. But you know, it obviously I, wasn't I, last I don't think Kenny needs my help here. I think he's fine. Shut so up. I'm just gonna go this way over here and try to open the door. Oh, the windows. Blocked by all the fallen concrete. Yep. Invisible but, walls, Gabe. You're not allowed. Fuck but, off. Ah. <sighs> Yeah, hmm. Lee does that whenever there's nothing specific to say about- Oh, you can look at the helicopter. He already did. No, I already did. Oh, okay. Actually, no, I didn't look at the helicopter, I looked at the sign. You're right. So much for the military. Yeah, that's the one- that's one thing that really messes me up. What causes a helicopter to crash in a zombie apocalypse? About that guy at well, like in Left 4 Dead, your helicopter pilot really? got bitten by a that zombie. A well, no, 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 remember, in Left 4 Dead, it's an of airborne infection. People get infected like that, you just have to be near wait, someone. Wait, wait, wait. No, you got bit. What do you say? What do you say? He just woke up in the middle of the night, screaming his head off. He thinks he killed Herschel's son. Oh, Christ. I'm what, sorry. Doc? Yeah. Oh, Fact of the matter is, anyway. we did. Wait. What? Yeah, you helped him save Doc. Oh, yeah. You sure him. you up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Yeah. Honestly, uh, uh, and there it goes. Shit! Fucking lied to us, Kenny. Ow, my head. That would be you and me, Gabe. You said you had it, Kenny. Not going to lie, that would be me and Gabe. Dude, are you okay? Jesus. Are you okay? I'm fine. Shit. I'm sorry, pal. I thought he'd be healed up better. You're lucky it wasn't any worse. You could have. Then this happens. Go! Go! Go that doesn't sound like a zombie. Help me! Yeah. Turns out there are still solo survivors in all of this. Wouldn't you know it? But she's dumb as hell. What the? What the, what the hell is that? Scream when you're getting chased by a zombie. Walker's still screaming. She's genre blind. I don't think so. Fair enough. How did she live this long? It's been like almost four months. Scavenging. It's a girl. We have to help her. How? There's no getting to her. We gotta do something. And that happens. Not how. And it's gone. Gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. You don't know we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive, and she draws them all to her, buying us time. Can't See, that's the thing. We're Kenny's the logical the thinker like I am. She we survive if she dies. But, lives. the other side, we could, you know, do the right thing and end her misery. If you want to, you can shoot her. But then the zombies will be attracted to you guys. If you don't shoot them... Boom. Headshot. Honestly, I've never wanted to be put through that. I won't give someone my gun, but I don't mind shooting them myself if they so wish. If she didn't wish for it, she would have bit. It doesn't matter. Oh god, this girl again! Yeah, Let's move. they reuse a lot of models. I, I want to assume it's the same one. You can assume it's the same one, but uh... Not exactly. How would the zombies even get up there? They didn't. They were probably on the other side. Remember, they're all over. They were probably on the other side of the truck and heard the screaming and the gunshots and came to the truck. I th no, I thought we were on top of a building, not up on an overpass. No. no. Fuck. You were on top of the truck Come and on, hopped Lee. over. It says. 
You are on top of the truck. You hopped over to get into the back. Sturdy as hell, but we ain't got much block. time. So get everything you can out of these racks. Grab as many as you can Don't in the time Mini the game, go. Time. I'll clear down here, and then we gotta go. Wait, I'm actually timed on this. Yes, you are. Come on. To be fair, you have infinite inventory in this, so all you gotta do is make sure you grab everything you can. The higher your score is, the better you'll you'll do. Go! Go! Up, oh, you're done. Yep. Yeah, it wouldn't let me move for a little while. You got a lot of Yeah, it Fuck. doesn't matter. I want more. Come on, Lee! Up and over. Yeah, you're not too injured for that, you dick. Well, yeah, it's not as far. It's awesome. Jimmy! Another one of these, I just have to hold it back. Yeah, because... Kenny, how did you get that far away? He ran. See, this is the scene that if you're nice to me, I'll be not nice. He fucking ditches you. Yeah. But you still make it kind of... You need, you need a high uh, friendship value with Kenny in order for him to save you there. If you don't, you save Let's yourself. But it, but it clearly marks that you and Kenny are not on the best of terms. Okay, um... Hope in the front one. Yeah. Nope. Yeah. Come on, get away. Come on, you dick butt. And he is no longer a threat to you. Well, he's still alive, but... He's not a threat. Get, get to running. Come on, Lee. You don't have time. Now. You can't put everyone out of there, Mr. Yeah. Kenny really didn't appreciate you shooting the chick because it wasn't the smart thing to do, but at the very least you built up enough high relationship values with him in previous events that, that he, he doesn't, doesn't care. give a fuck. Yeah. Yeah, the thing you know what's is funny, what if there was a game basically where a per where it's a zombie apocalypse and someone goes around cuz they decide they want to put everyone out of their misery of having to be a zombie, so they're going to save everybody by killing all of the zombies. Just as long as they don't kill uh, living people, it's fine. If they're yeah. bitten, they would kill them. Yeah, pretty much. And this is what the camp has been reduced to. Mm, could be worse. Yeah, but, you know, not exactly the uh, quote-unquote haven it was before. Because you and Clementine don't, don't buy, uh, and I put them didn't, on my didn't walkie. take the food. Uh, have really big uh, that's neat. did you see that? I'll find what? you in a minute. It looked like it was glitched out. It looked like it was floating in front of her hand. Probably because it was trying to load the next scene. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone and come and rape our women and children. Yeah, Kenny d tends to uh, blow things out of proportion. Yeah. So, what did you get? <sighs> what was Just left? Just what was left. Which was a lot, actually. Take a look. We're fine, by the way. Yeah, if you nice do that, then Kenny this remarks on how many going. you actually got. If we carry on like this, we'll get what? through the winter here. The items. The winter? When you say, we'll when you don't directly say how much you got, Kenny will point out too. for you Your if you did well or not on the mini game. So yeah. Appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the wall, Lily. That's not graffiti. You already told Those are you bullet holes. Leave. Yeah, I know. And we got enough air stand sticking by that. out of it to dry our laundry. And that's all beside the fact that Macon is busting at the seams with walkers. We don't have walker problems. I was listening we to We have to go about. eventually, Lily. We don't have to do anything. You didn't want to go because of your dad's health. But he's gone now. Easy, Kenny. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly. Come on, Don't Kenny. boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable anymore. And don't start with me, either. Ken, we're all losing it with the attacks and lack of food. We're strongest together. You can't we got be so you much versus food last us, time. How much y'all been We're sorry for what no happened more. to your dad, it's but only been a we're week. in this together now. It doesn't matter. It's been what a week the in... Situation? Yeah. We killed her dad. He, what about it's when been a week. He killed her dad. And truth be told, Somebody's gotta be a thinking about what this was in that shit. car was not a week's worth of food. How has this not been working? What we have, have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. That's Remember, Lily was the one doing the rationing, and what she's losing medicine? her mind. Guys, what about medicine? 
We got all the protection we need. No, I didn't. And when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? They won't be going back over. No, I can't hear Everything them correctly because for some reason it doesn't do the subtitles. To pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. We wouldn't even be fighting about our medicine and supply stocks if Lee hadn't fucked up downtown. What do you mean? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She was making enough noise that we would have had plenty of time to get what we needed. Instead, smart guy die? shot her. You get more time. He what? He put her out of her misery. Stupid. Instead of what? Letting her suffer? You guys couldn't try to save her? You shot her instead. I couldn't, I couldn't let her suffer. suffer. We're all suffering. Some more than others. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. Y'all should be giving Lee hell for not doing what needed to be done. It's not so easy for him. Look, making it people though. aren't saving. Yeah, well, it's not don't much out shit, it's people. Full of yeah, Car Carly no, doesn't people enjoy the fight. No, that will go with Shorter like, nah, he's killed someone before. It's what are you talking about? On Earth, <laughs> and it's coming this way. It's not going to be easier out on the road. How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right, stealing. And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. Wow. Now everybody get out. So she's losing her mind. Not losing her mind, but she's stressed as hell. She's losing her mind. Bad blood. Shit's just getting worse by the day. Hey, man. She's not helping, is she? Why did my laptop keep doing this? Okay. It goes into sleep mode. I said it's a wooden if it's plugged in, though. Huh? She's right about uh, one thing. None of this is getting any easier. <sighs> man. <sighs> Things are coming to a head. Hey, Carly. What's up, babe? Hey, well, I think you did good today. You wanna go in one of these rooms? Come on, guys. It's probably worth following kidding. up with Lily about what she was saying Lee about missing the supplies. Yeah, I mean, he hasn't had pussy in four months. The way she is, I don't want to. I mean, he probably paranoid. didn't get pussy before that because no his wife question. was cheating on him. Fair point. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Justin, is there any chance I can swap spots with you? Sure. I can't really see over it very well. I can't see the subtitles sometimes. Yeah, that's fine. I already know what happened, so I don't need to read them. Alright. I'm assuming no timeline, right? Nope. Alright. You now get to free roam. Go talk to Clummy Clue! Question. What was set off events? Let's see. Um, the next series of events is, that will move you forward in the story is started by talking to Lily. You can talk to everyone else. I almost spoke to her first. That's why I need to know that. Yeah. However, doing that doesn't block you off from talking to other people. It just opens the door to to the rest of the story for the episode. Talk to Clummy okay. Clue. So, just a second. I need to talk to Ben. I need to see how he's doing after the events hey, that dude. happened. What's up, Lee? No one cares about Ben. I care about Ben. Like Ben's ben. a fuckboy. Like Did you ever come Ben's down here boy. to make it much? I didn't have much reason to. My parents would let me take the car into the city on the weekend. But what's in Macon? Fair enough. It's kind of a waste of time compared to Atlanta. I grew up in What I say, he's a fuckboy. Oh. I like I him. Say he's a fuckboy. He's just honest. He's a fuckboy. He, he's super nice. Honest. 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 I mean, not now, he's but a I bet it was. Is. Yeah, he's trying to be nice. What do you think about Lily? She scares the crap out of me. He's just a little That's awkward. A he's a fucking thing. teenage she, boy. He's Look, a fuckboy. I'm just worried she's fucking going like to Fucking like you snack. can talk? You're an awkward teenage boy too. Have you seen I'm 21. You Guys. Fucking, is there like anybody out there? You want to fucking go, mate? No. Nope. This fucking guy, really mate. Quiet. Ah, fuck. Really? Mm -hmm. Yeah, totally. Which is good. Talk to you later, Ben. Bye. All right. I like Ben. Don't you like Ben? Ben's a nice enough guy, and he actually worries about what people think and feel. He worries about offending people, but he is honest, which is better than a lot of people in this ap apocalyptic hellhole. He's a fuckboy. Uh... Honestly, he was honest to me about how he feels about Lily, and that's something I appreciate. He's a fuckboy. You know what? Friggin' Wait, here. what did he say about Lily again? I was scares the hell out of him. How are you doing? She's a We're bitch. okay. 
Just having loose. I mean, staff. she has issues. We all but, carry guns you know, now, and who doesn't? Well, I don't like it. It's the way it's gotta be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. That's fair. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? <sighs> you guys trust you guys, everyone here? Uh, trust everyone here? Can I have more water? More or less. I obviously yeah, have my problems with Lily, but Thank you. I don't distrust her. Yeah, we can't turn on each other any more than we have. About, About the, the guns. guns? Don't you start. I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. <sighs> but sure. we need them. There's no doubt about that. You need to try, harder, need to with try harder with Lily. You guys gotta straighten this out. I don't know how straight we can get it, given all that's happened. Let's see. You I really wish Lily was a lesbian. Time will so come. We we'll have to do what's best Well, you're never gonna get it straight with Lily. And that's what we'll do. She's gay. Well, we don't know she's not a lesbian. We don't know anyone's official sexual orientation. We just make assumptions based on how they act. Well, I'm pretty sure it's actually stated. I would number one say that Kenny is probably straight. I cannot see Kenny willing to have sex with a man. Well, he comes from Florida. He no, he's either straight or bisexual. That's obvious considering the fact that he has a wife and a child. Yeah. But I would say that he would never be with a man, so he's probably just straight. Uh, considering the fact that he doesn't like black people, it's probably not, to be. It's probably fair not to so much he, he was, doesn't like black people. But he's racist. That means he probably has some homophobia. In Talk there to well. Lily. Well, yeah. I mean, he likes Lee. No, Lee's pretty yet. black. I will. He said. You know how to pick a lock, right? What? what no. I to say was, you know you're urban. He, thinks, he he knows some you. stereotypes of black people. He he believes the stereotypes of yeah. black people. Well, you would believe. Whoa, the wait, wait, wait. Shh, guys. Cass. You know what? Sure. About you too. Oh yeah. Come oh yeah. About to get that pussy. Come on, Gabe. <laughs> tap, that do it, do it. tap that you're ass. Tap that ass. You're small. Boy. Hey, hold on. You're a convicted killer. Carly. Jesus. And I think <laughs> like we were a cutesy not talking. This is not something you bring up. I figured. You're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't I see Lily really talk about that. you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell. I everyone, bet Carly's about Cass's height. Think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. Maybe a little taller. Fair enough. Honestly, I kind of forget who was stealing from them. You're probably right. Also, don't talk about the. Of course, I'm probably right. Don't talk no, I'm about just saying it. I forgot. Yeah, yeah, you're not. You're not allowed to. You're not even allowed to mention that. And telling them trouble, but it will be a far cry stealing. from what'll happen. That could be paranoia. Yeah. Well, was, I mean, everyone was since you. I don't remember if someone was or if so they were who it was. I do. I remember most everything from this episode, but I don't spoil things because you know, get playing through it. You're totally right. Good. I think it's. So are you gonna go tell Lily? Well, you gotta pick and choose who you tell. Alright. Oh. Oh. Hey, wait. Small. Yeah, slut, fuck off! Hey. No. She might be small, but you got a big something else. Booty? Probably. We never got a good booty, shot of her ass. Booty, 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 booty rocking everywhere. Booty, 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 booty rocking everywhere. Booty, 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 booty rocking everywhere. Okay, guys, can we keep the topic a little bit on the game? It is. It's on the topic of Carly's butt. Who knows she got that booty person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. Fair enough. But the one with the best booty of all is Lee. Do you, you feel, feel safe, safe here? here? He has no booty. Show she me a that. bath with a heated you. floor you and a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied jeans. Malbec and then I'll feel safe. Get that man in a G-string. I don't know. This place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. You, uh... Have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her. That's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. I'm gonna look Fair into enough. this thing. Good idea. Are you gonna go tell Clummy Clue? You got to. Mm -hmm. Uh, Clementine already knows. Yeah, but it, yeah, but it's worth talking to her about to make sure she understands the scenario. Hey, she... okay. hey Lee. Like, remember, you mentioned it in passing to her before Who's trying to explain it. It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. That leaf looks like shit. Shit! Don't you talk See, to me about Clinic Clue. It's the same. Um, kind of. <laughs> That's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Oh my god, I think there's a really cute Clementine moment coming up. <laughs> so, do you like it here? Do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. 
Maybe if I knew where? Yeah, that'd be a good thing to know. Alright. I might wait to... The problem is, I don't want anyone else overhearing, but I also don't... No, no one else will overhear it. If you tell someone, the others in the group will not overhear it. You Only the people you tell specifically will. Right. Clem, I need to talk to you for a second. Okie dokie. Okie dokie, artichokey. The day you and I met, I was in a car accident. I remember. Your leg was bleeding. The car I was in was, was a period. police car. And I was on my way to jail for committing a crime. I need to tell you now, because I don't want you to hear it any other way. Okay. Do you have anything to say? I don't think so. You can uh, go on back to your things. So you didn't exactly tell her you killed someone, but you did tell her you went you were going to jail. That's the important part about what Lee's trying to tell people. Because what Carly meant to tell what Carly meant by telling everyone is this. Killing someone isn't a big deal. The point is telling everyone who you were and the fact that you were willing to kill before killing was acceptable. Yeah. Well, I mean, you might not have been willing to kill, it just might have been overtaken by anger. I, when you're either, it, it doesn't specify the situation either, that I want to talk about. Either that. way, you need to be a either way it needs to be said because no one wants to assume Lee's a murderer or psychopath who will kill in their sleep. Because all it takes is one person finding out the wrong way. You should probably and, tell Kenny. Yeah, but the problem is that Katya I'm hoping she won't be distressful, especially around Duck. Do you want me to tell you anything about about anyone you will tell? Because I can't I can tell you how they will react if you tell them. Tell me Katya's reaction. Katya will be concerned, but she will still trust you. Alright. And... Kenny, you've already built enough relationship yeah. value that he'll trust you regardless. Alright, Katya, I'll can I... will talk to you later. I meant to hit... Really? Kenny, you got a no, second? It changed them! I need to tell you something. You dick! Sure, well, you can uh, tell Kenny. What you got? Fine. Besides, telling Kenny is also important. I it... know, I was gonna tell him second. Is that just, like, watching over all y'all, like, Batman up there? That's X-Men. No. X-Men is... Guys. What? On my way to prison three months ago. No shit. No shit. I'm fixing his stereotype. It wasn't protecting kids, was it? Well, I mean... You're black. Come on, man. Wait, what did he say? It wasn't protecting kids, was it? Hmm. Must have been a real piece of shit if you had to haul off and kill him. So we're straight then. Fair enough. Lee, look at everything this mess has got us doing now. I'm sorry you went through whatever you went through. Yeah, we're straight. <laughs> he looked down at your dick. I think he thinks you think so, okay. Yeah, I saw, saw that Yeah, time. I saw that too. Ah! It's terrifying! The ghost <laughs> of Kenny. Ghost Kenny. Like Ghost Ray. Can I talk to you about something? I need to talk to you. Sure. Is everything okay? Katja, I'm pregnant, and you're the father. Why can't I do it with Kenny there? Because you have to tell the people individually. Kenny would tell Katja, and that would, re but she it wouldn't raise her relationship values because you didn't tell her. As on my uh, on my way to prison three months ago. You've oh, three months ago. So it's literally just been three months since the beginning of the game. I wonder if you could still mm, do that. Yeah. Well, three months in a week. No, I was a three months. Fella. Well, no, oh, three months. Yes. No, remember. How much trouble can a teacher get into? Well, I cheated on a lot of tests but for my nothing to do with that. Well, if we're talking about cheating, it I cheated on tests, and then my wife cheated on me for Why? cheating on the test, and then, you know, I cheated on this guy's life That's enough. with my fist. Tell me what happened when you were locked in the fridge at the dairy. All right. I held Lily back, and Kenny made sure Larry didn't get up. What did he do? He I had a lot of salt to his diet. <gasps> yeah. I have, oh, I can't wait till episode four. All right. Oh, part four. Everything keeps well, no, changing. Four. Yeah, episode four. Episode 4 is when everything... What did she say? Everything mm -hmm. keeps changing. Yeah, Katja doesn't really get why you killed the dude, but it does rela raise relationship Ivy. values to tell her. You don't. You can't talk to Ivy. Him. He just... No, no, no. I'm not talking to... Ivy. I'm not talking to you! 
they're kind of conjoined at this point. No, I just wanted to see what he would say if I did it after he was. Ben, 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 you, you. I just met you, man. I don't want you to think I'm a murderous psychopath. Uh, I mean, you could tell everybody except Duck, because Duck's a fuckboy. I won't tell Duck. He's two. And his he's parent... older than Clementine, but you know. It doesn't matter. He's a he's a fucking. Monkey. I think he's like ten. Yeah, Clem's like. Clem in this wait, is like wait, nine. Wait, right? wait, wait. Eight or nine. Wait, come on. I need a pivot. There we go. Ha ha! I'm magic. <laughs> I always enjoy doing th- stupid things like that. Um, so are you gonna tell Ben? No, he's a fuckboy. boy. We'll have a bad reaction. Just tell me yes or no. I have not tested with Ben because I don't trust Ben. However. I will say this. If you don't do it, it won't affect your relationship values with him. But if you do do it, like this event right here is where you start building trust with people to get higher relationship values. You haven't had a a significant point to do that with Ben previous to this point. So if you want to test it and see if it raises his relationship values, a.k.a. he will remember it, you can test it. Alright. Please tell us in the comments below if I'm right. Uh... Or if, you know, if I'm wrong, because that happens occasionally. Hey, Ben, I need to tell you something. Sure. I met you a week ago, but I'm a murderer. I'm trying to do a good job. You're doing fine. He's a fuckboy. I'm a convicted murderer! I was, uh, on my way to prison before this. Whoa, seriously? What, um, were you in for? That is so awkward. What are you in for? Oh. Sorry, sorry, Lee. If you hear I'm going through that teenage puberty. Uh, I'm sorry. Guys, thanks for trusting me, man. I, uh, I... Ben, relax. Okay. Oh, Ben's so cute. Sorry, Lee. I, I just don't know ben how to Ben will forget that. Do-do-do-do. All right, so now the only one you can tell is Lily. All right, Lily, we need to have a talk. Can I have the water? To your door. Gabe. Okay, to you. Gabe, what? Cassie wants you to make her moist. Can I have the water? Sure. Thank you. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? <sighs> Honestly... I wanted to follow up on what you said about stolen supplies. Do you know what's going on? I don't. I just heard you mention it. And you came in here to confess? I'm not stealing shit. I came in here to help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of us, out yeah, there. Yeah, unfortunately, because you didn't they help with her dad, her relationship values with you dropped tremendously. Yeah, you haven't really been sleeping. Don't start in on that. You've been through a trauma, and you're not taking care of yourself. It counts off, and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I oh. see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. That's fair, honestly. What's there to go on? You're not asking me to start. I found this tossed anyone. into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. Okay, okay, I'll poke around. I'll poke around a little bit. Honestly, and that's fair. If you don't find anything, yeah. I'm just going she to She might be losing her mind, you. but her points are valid still. Except for that one. If you don't find anything, I'm going to assume it's you. A mystery. Then, Fuck off, you Jesus. fuck boy. I'm Duck's sorry. a kid. Um, I heard you guys talk. I get why you don't like you Duck, but I can un- but that. I see him as just a stupid kid. Can He's I not help? a fuck boy. Ben's the fuck boy. What did I just say? You're the Grayson. What did I just say? And I can be Dick Grayson. Your war. I like him for the Batman reference. That's Robin. I know who it is. <laughs> Fine. You're Robin. Okay, you're Robin. Yes. What do I do? He's a fucking I don't know. Dork. Go look around. Let me know if you find anything. There's a really cute weird. funny moment coming up, right? I'm yeah, there the is. Honestly, Duck, Duck is... He's a fucking dork! And I love it! He's a dork. He needs to... He, he needs he he needs to calm down, Hey, Gabe, though. um, at this point, do you want to pause it? 
Because we've been recording for like 38 minutes. Oh, we have? Yep. It's already that late into the episode? Yep. Okay, it's not quite 38 minutes because I think we had like five minutes beforehand where we weren't doing anything. Yeah. But guys, next time on The Walking Dead, we, we begin be our Batman adventure playing as Lee Everett, the 78th Batman, and young Duck Grayson. 78th? Oh. Wait, isn't this the second black Batman? Nope. There the hasn't been a black Batman. The yet. 78th Batman and the first black one. There has not been a black Batman yet. I know there's a black Spider-Man, but I'm pretty sure there was well, one Well, there's going to be a black Spider-Man. There already there, is or, a black Spider-Man. It's the comics. Oh. Miles Morales, half Puerto Rican, half black, and the second point. Spanish Spider-Man to Miguel O'Harris, Spider-Man in 2099. Okay, we're not talking about this anymore. Guys, we'll see you guys next time. <laughs>